for the queen's nest. Fast hive, fast defiler, swarming the crap out of this. He knows it's pointless to attack this without proper equipment. Second bunker going down for just that. Here goes the hive. And it gets scanned. This might be if kid needs to get well wants to get into this game because I can't say back into this game because he hasn't been into the game yet. He needs to benefit from that expansion and get it going. He's researching stuff now. It's probably gonna be arranged because I think he might have had stim already. I haven't seen him use yet. I haven't seen any medics. There's fire bats though. And he's switching to everything. Building another barracks. Also building a second factory. He did survive in part because of mines. Last game I believe. Or it was I no that was the the T V T's, I'm sorry. Uh Lugs are out. Be sent in one by one. I don't know why there's so few. You oh yeah, the hive. Right. Spire now also going down. The hive is done. Apparently, Nevrilur is scared of drops, which he should be, as the starport is being built. Back alleyway is cleared. He is going out. Those firebats took the wrong way around. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. I hope he sees this. It's going to expand there, apparently. <gasps> oh, stop, lurkers! Oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, I love Zerg. I absolutely love Zerg. That was... perfect. What the fuck coming from, kid? <laughs> oh, dear. Wrong move. Thanks, there. So be careful for splash. Whoa! Pop goes the weasel. That was a little bit <laughs> problem there. Zerglings, Zerglings, Zerglings. Like is being assailed. But he needs to keep his scans. Here comes the dropship. Sadly, there are already... Well, there is already one sunken colony in place. We already have the defile amount up as well. We don't see the defile up as personally yet. And we also have the wonderful Altulus Cavern already being built. Right. Kid needs to do a lot of damage with these drops. He's spending now, finally taking his third. The dropship is there, going straight for the main. The creep colony has not been spawned yet. Oh, but we've got some units in here. We might actually be at the right place at the right time. We've got the sunken colony. It's getting spotted. It's going further in. No! What are you doing? That was absolutely stupid. Landing right in front. Why are you landing in front of the sunken colony? Don't! Right, this drop is stopping before it was even started. That was not 
the way to do it. Oh, these links apparently bypassed the expansion. This is looking grim for Kid. And that's an understatement. He's in his base. He's going to try and move out. He's going to scan, killing the last lurker there. But oh, looky here, there's some more. Oh, look at that. Street forces streaming from the Zerg base here. Oh, he needs to move in. The swarm is down. He needs to burrow very quickly. The tanks need to get out of there. The job well done. That's most of Kid's forces now completely down the drain. He's got his science vessels up, but... Oh, God, where's the defile? He needs to plant down the swarm. Which he does just in time. He's in range. Going to hop it now, and that's going to be it. He's inside the front base. A miracle needs to happen now for Kid to actually make even a considerable comeback. Bunkers are down. GG coming from Kid, and that's it. Neville takes his weekly number 33. Wow. 15 minutes and that, and that was actually quite a good game. So there you have it, folks. Weekly number 33 is over. Thanks for watching. Thanks for playing. And I'm going to stop it right there because I am absolutely tired. So, see you next time. and Bye-bye.